Good evening, everybody. Welcome to the UKW Arena here in Batley. It is February, and it is the week after Revolutionary Road, and we are here for the Friday night showdown pre-show. There you go. It's always a mouthful to say that. So uh, I am Brett Hadley. Hello. I've got a bit of a cold. I do apologise for me sniffling a lot tonight. Uh, I'm here with Shelby Sino. Hello. Hello. Good evening. You all right? I'm good, thank you. You recovered from Saturday yet? Just. <laughs> And I'm very cold. It's cold out here today. It is cold out here, and I've got a cold. Um, it's cold everywhere. Um, and the trains are on strike, which is not worrying us. Yes, but, I heard about that, but I'm yeah. lucky enough that I don't need to get trains. No, hence why I got here like well, <laughs> five minutes ago. But never mind. Uh, we're here to talk wrestling. Yes, we are on the uh, the the heels of Revolutionary Road, and what a show that was! It was a long old night, wasn't it? Was it was a long one. <laughs> it was, and a lot happened. We have got a new UK wrestling heavyweight champion. Yep. We have an official undisputed television champion. Yep. We have tag team champions. We have, well, we got two new around the clock champions. Two new. Yeah, we did. Brother. We did get two new around the clock champions. Brother. Uh, and yeah, we, we had a good night. Um, so if you want to watch Revolution Road, it'll be up on the Omni on Network soon, I understand. Yes. And uh, yeah, JPR unfortunately lost his heavyweight championship. <laughs> Yeah, to Paul sadly hubris. to Paul Hubris. Which means that we've lost not one but two titles yeah, to America this because week. Because Sean Reed also claimed the television championship and they both toddled off to America with them. They did. They uh, returned back to America on Monday. Although, this is week, Sean Reed gone? Because last I knew she was having customs issues. Well. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I heard that she, uh, yeah. There, was some, there was some flight issue issues. Flight. There was all sorts of issues with But with I presume Jordan. that the Armada will have sorted each other out. Yeah, yeah. Paul, uh, Paul Hubris is definitely in America, though, because he's have been seen posting it. Have you seen it? Yeah, yes. he's been with Al Snow in America. and Super Yeah. So the titles are no longer in the UK uh, because the Armada have the heavyweight championship and the television championship it is a thing we, we didn't want it to come true but it did it did indeed so that means that we will only see three wow. titles this week the tag titles tag titles but that's not a tag title match we'll get to the tag division in a bit because that's a big thing and the round, tonight. round the clock belt we'll probably see Sheep McToom um, well he lost the around the clock championship to Chris Castle but then he got it back he did he gained it back rather um, immediately didn't he uh, Revolutionary Road is worth watching just to see Sheep McToom uh, questionable. Well, yeah, okay. <laughs> that, that you know that whole that whole thing, Sheik McToom, brother, Sheiky Mania, running wild. I tell you what is the <laughs> the thing that is worth watching Revolutionary Road for, and that was the return of Mayhem. Oh, oh, that was, oh, oh that was amazing. Raja, which was incredible. Uh, we have Rampage Brown and Rohan Raja in that ring. Me and Sid Phoenix sat here in absolute awe of what those two men were doing. I, oh my God. I really enjoyed it because I wasn't sat here. I no. was upstairs in the uh, audio visual you're, booth. You were watching it So from... I got to properly watch it. Yeah. Oh really, my really God. Good, so, those um, two put on a entertaining match. It is a hard hitting affair. Yeah. Uh, not spoiling what happens obviously yep. but if you want to watch it it's on Mayhem. It's on the UKW network. Exclusively. It is. You can't see it anywhere network. else. We're not going to show it on YouTube or anything. You have to Unless get it on the network. Unless you come, yeah. And our next so, pay-per-view, um, Pride and Glory, comes your way February 25th. the 25th. Yeah, it is. You're right. Which I am... I, t- I don't know about you, Brett, but I am very happy that February is a short month. Yeah. Because January was awfully oh, long. Oh, January went on for like 86 days. Forever. Yeah, it seemed to, didn't it? Legitimately, yeah. it just seemed to go on and on and on. Did. And we're already <laughs> three days into February, so... Which only has 28 days Which only year. has 28 days, yeah, yeah. so that's a good thing. But on the 25th, you can come here and see another Mayhem taping. More action... Uh, and also, don't get Super Showdown comes your way. Super Showdown. I'm not too sure what Super about it though. Yeah. Me neither. When is that? Uh, it's is that the 17th. The okay. Yeah, 17th. Okay. February the 17th. Two weeks tonight. Uh, and you can come and join us. I mean, this we've got a decent crowd again. It's here busy for, again, yeah. For a show. I, when I arrived to the venue, I saw all the people outside. I was like, oh, this is a good thing. It's full. Um, we like it. If you want to come and join us, book your tickets on the UK Wrestling app, and you can subscribe to the UKW Network. It's about four quid. That's what we worked it out at. Four yeah. English pounds, or five dollars five in American money. And it's about the price of a cup of coffee, isn't it, these days? Oh, absolutely. Sorry. <sighs> and, um, yeah, you can... Today. Try, you can... T- um, join us on the network. There's over 130 hours of classic UKW content yeah. on there at and the moment. And there's more to come, isn't yes, there? Yes, there's always more. I was more. chatting with... There's loads Cedric. of it. 
and there's a lot more to come. So. There is. Every Very single exciting. WrestleBration event, all 13 of them that have happened so far, We're some of them feature me and you, yeah, they or quite a lot feature me and you, to be fair. I think all of them will feature either me or you. In some, I think you might be right. There might not be many that I want to go back and, and find out <laughs> if that's true. But I, think I know I did, I did photos at some, I ring announced some, and I've commentated some. Yeah. So, and yeah. I've ring announced some, wrestled on one, wrestled on two maybe. <laughs> you wrestled on the outdoor one, um, didn't you? I did, I wrestled on that. Was, that. that was when I ro- won my women's belt. And that's when I was doing photos. So, go. yeah, there we go. <laughs> We're on quite a lot of them between us. Yes, uh, but you can go on the Academy <laughs> Network and you can watch every single WrestleMania. Also, launching, uh, if somebody in my ear can tell me, it launches tomorrow, does it not? The UKW television channel. Does, February the 4th. Let me just check on the. Uh, somebody somebody the confirm this to me. I think it's February the 4th. Channels. Yeah, I'm sure it is. You can watch it on many devices, including your Amazon Fire Stick, your Roku devices. Oh, and, it's on the, yeah. and many others and on that it'll be a 24 hour streaming TV channel of us it's very very exciting <laughs> it is so exciting looking forward to it we have so much going on but yeah Mayhem make sure you catch it uh, for that match between Rohan Raja and Rampage Brown it was a bit of a war and the crowd absolutely loved it we loved it sat here Shelby loved it upstairs and um, hopefully you'll love it as well if you watch it on oh, it the UKW say. network it doesn't say. say I'm sure it's February the 4th but if somebody can hear me uh, can tell me that'd be great um, also so we're talking about the tag team division tonight the Super Tag League starts Let's it begins, begins. Uh, on the heels of Saturday where NRG, Hamza and Mo successfully, yay, defended their titles. And yes. I, when you said NRG, Hamza and Mo, I was like, who is the third person? Well, <laughs> There's only two of them. They did defend their tag titles successfully, <laughs> which I'm very happy about. Against the Dogs of War and the Persian Empire. It was a triple threat elimination. It came down to the Dogs of War and NRG, and NRG walked out of here with the belts. Which you were thrilled about. I'm sorry. Yeah, it's good stuff. Um, but it does mean that tonight is the start of the Super, Super Tag League, Tag League yes. which isn't for a, t- a shot at the title belts, we discovered. No, we thought it, well, originally it was going to be, but no, that's it's because. For the king of the. Well. Bragging rights. Bragging rights. But that's because the tag team champions are in the Blooming Thing. They are in it. <laughs> and you'll see in them in action the... tonight. So I just loaded on my device yes. the yeah. brackets, which have been announced this week <laughs> on social media. Oh, yeah, we've got um, some mystery teams. We'll we get do. to them in a bit. So just we don't know who they are. Is made, bracket one is made up of the UK Wrestling Tag Team Champions, NRG. Yep. And Joe Sedgwick and Johan Hunt represent the Persian Empire. Yep. And then two mystery teams. Yes, and the two mystery teams you will find out when I find out tonight. And when you find out tonight, yes. we'll see who the mystery teams are. The other two bracket. mystery teams. That's a lot of mystery teams. And they face each other tonight. And they face each other. Yes. So it's very exciting. Yeah, yeah. Well, so who's in the other bracket? Is Jonathan Sedgwick and Mustafa Khan. Oh, okay. Representing the Persian Empire, I yep. believe. At the Brotherhood. Uh, representing the firing squad. The Yorkshire Tears. Doing it for Yorkshire. <laughs> no, you had to do it, sorry. And the Dogs of War. I'm not barking. No. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> so there you go. You've got the uh, the eight teams there. Now, the way this works, to my understanding, is if you win, you, you face each team in your bracket once. Yeah. And if you win, you get three points, like if you win a football match. Mm-hmm. If you draw, so the, the matches are 15 minutes each. We have to stress this. Yeah. There's a time limit. I'll sit here with the bell, and after 15 minutes, if nobody has won or anything, it becomes a draw. It does. And both teams get one point. Or, un- if, po- un- or if there's a count, is it like a double count? Out yeah, yeah, yeah. There's, there's, there's no decisive winner. All sorts of yeah. Um, but if you lose cleanly, you get absolutely, nothing, positively nothing. Nothing at all. Nothing in this game for a loss. No. And then it's the top two scores yes. of each of each bracket. So each that side, we'll yeah. Next time. So yeah, the two teams then will face off at Pride and Glory. Yeah. In the final for bragging rights. Very. So you got three points for a win, one point for a draw, nothing for a loss. So it's all about the points. Point, point, point. Yes, and it begins tonight. It does. Uh, with the Persian Empire against NRG again. Yep. But we'll never get tired of seeing this because they, they have amazing matches. All the matches they've had together or with other teams have been brilliant. Yep. Tonight, hopefully, here on Showdown will be another one of them. That would be but, good. And they'll be both teams will want to get, you know, it's the importance of points. They'll want yep. to be the king of the tag team ladder. Absolutely. You know, NRG will have a point to prove as champions. The Persian Empire as former two-time champions. You know, there's a lot of <laughs> um, lot to play for. Realistically, in those brackets, yep. the only team that doesn't, only two teams other than the mystery teams that don't currently have champions, Iron, are the Brotherhood and the Yorkshire Tears. 
uh, and the dogs of war. Because the dogs of war have had the Genesis Championship. They have both of them. They however, both yeah, had the Genesis quite. Championship. Mustafa Khan and Jonathan Sedgwick, how they're not both Grand Slam title holders, They've I have no loads idea. of titles, yes. NRG are obviously our current mm-hmm. reigning and defending tags. The Persian <laughs> Empire have had the tag belts between yeah, them. Yeah. So our mystery teams are going to have to step up, aren't they? Because there's been a lot of gold held by far out of the six yeah, yeah. that have so already been announced. We will so see who can uh, get the points. It starts tonight on Showdown and it will conclude at Pride and Glory on the 25th of February. Yeah, so we've got three weeks, yep. three exciting weeks of tag team wrestling. Yep. We like our tag team wrestling here. I do Ukraine. like a lot of tag team wrestling. It's good, yeah. And we've got some great tag teams here. They'll all be on show right here tonight. Also on we show tonight. We don't just have tag team wrestling, though. This is it. Oh, no, no. No, we have, we have triple, triple threat. threat. We, it wouldn't be us without a triple threat it now, would it? It wouldn't be uh, Friday Night Showdown without no. at least one triple I'm threat. I'm going to have to have a drink. I'm really sorry. <laughs> um, it wouldn't be us without having a triple threat. But in our triple threat this evening is Young Horace, Tommy mm. Dillon, and returning to Friday Night Showdown, Mr. Evan Knight, oh, who is normally on Friday uh, Wednesday. Wednesday night, night ignite. ignite. He's so, cocky, that kid. I tell you. Yeah, he's got, I can a, he's got a McCain on his shoulder. Oh, he's got a chip the size a chip. of. Oh my. Other brands are available. Yeah, um, but other he, chips are available. He, um, he went straight into the locker room this evening, and, and I did hear him talking about Young Horace. So. Well, did you know tonight, Shelby Sarnar, is Young Horace's 100th wrestling match? It is Young yes. Horace's 100th wrestling match. And did you also know that it's Mr. Tommy Dillon's birthday? Yeah, I did know this. So yeah. we have two celebrations in well, the this evening. Well, I hate to sour on this, but Tommy Dillon, what are you doing? Yeah, he needs to make a decision, doesn't he, really? Uh, on Saturday night again at the end of Revolutionary Road the last image we saw was shocking Tommy Dillon cost Big Duncan his match he turned on Big Duncan the fans and aligned seemingly aligned himself with the Alpha Predator Mm -hmm. Rex Savage Um, and after the match Duncan I don't know what's going on with Duncan but he was bereft he was devastated he threw his it's, yeah, I thought it's difficult, isn't yeah. it? Because we couldn't can't quite talk, tell. I can't talk about we it. We couldn't tell if it was a retirement, if it was a leaving everything in the ring this sort of situation. We couldn't tell if he was just done for the night and was disappointed in his match. I don't know. I mean, know I what get being disappointed. Was. I can get the deflation, that, like you don't want to lose, okay. But then he came up here, looked me dead in the eye he as shook a friend. Your hand, looked straight shook, past me. He I don't shook know my what hand, I did wrong. nodded and went, thanks for everything, I'm done, and walked off. Those were his exact words to me. Well, like I say, he's a friend, but I have no idea what was what he was doing, what he was thinking, or anything. It's interesting. So who knows? So we'll have to see what happens with Duncan. But Tommy Dillon, on his birthday, no less, in action against Young Horace and that cocky Evan Knight from Ignite rhymes. He won, didn't he? A he, he two. Well, yeah, <laughs> with the aid of a low blow and some nefarious tactics mm. with his pink nails. Pink nails. <laughs> and his pink jacket and everything. Yeah, he. We do uh, love some pink on, on he, uh, I mean, I, I, I can't say anything in a bright pink hoodie tonight, but you know. Yeah. Anyway, yeah, he he did get the victory over Brett Sedgwick at the weekend, um, and was very happy with himself for doing it. <laughs> like it doesn't matter. He said to me afterwards, it doesn't matter how I won, I won. I still won. Yeah, I mean, basically. Realistically, if, if you win, then you do win. Yeah, but he, had a, po- not he had a point, but it was the way he went about it. I didn't really like. Yeah. But you know. I mean, we didn't have to commentate on it, but I imagine no. if we did, we wouldn't have been very happy. No, I don't think I would have been very happy. Also, though, speaking of Genesis Ignite, we got a new champion on that brand. Did you know about? We this? do indeed. I did get to see that match actually. It was Sebastian Mercenary. Uh, Sebastian Mercer is With now an, your another triple threat match. <laughs> another triple threat match. <laughs> holla holla holla! Uh, is now your Genesis champion. He defeated um, Bishop and, Bishop uh, and Kirsten, Kirsten Riley. Riley, who was on a roll. Everybody thought the you know the whole momentum was with Kirsten Riley. He hadn't lost. He was he was on a yeah, complete roll for two months. I think, yeah, yeah. The... Uh, but no, Sebastian Mercer walked out of pushing limits to your new champion. Apparently on Wednesday night ignite. Uh, which is soon to go on YouTube. It's not up yet. It's not up yet. No, but it will be soon. Sebastian Mercer and his celebration victory speech. Um, I think there's something else we need to talk about from Wednesday Night Ignite. Did you see the social media this week, Brett? <clears throat> Unfortunately, yes. I did. We have a new general manager on Wednesday Night Ignite. 
Leone I don't even want to talk about it, Brian. No. <laughs> like, Leonie Rose has been appointed the new general manager for, for Wednesday Night Ignite. I mean, Mustafa Khan must have, I mean, obviously. Lost his mind. Yeah, what's like, he doing? What is he actually doing? Why? I mean, first off, Leonie Rose failed in her attempt to win back the UK yes, Wrestling Women's did. Championship. She lost to Kirsty Love, just saying. But then, like you said, on yesterday morning, we all go on our phones and see... Look who's fit. New general manager and of Ignite. But she was wearing a shirt. I've like, never seen her wear a shirt in my hell? life. Like, oh, it's this bit, girl. Like, yeah. I'm, I'm all behind female leadership and well, wanting yeah. women to, to, like, boss this business. But Leonie Rose... Surely we could have really? found somebody better than that anywhere. I mean, I would have done it if you'd have paid me enough. <laughs> like, but, you know. Come on. Yeah, anyway. I can't imagine what they're paying her, though. Oh, my gosh. Well, that's the Persian Empire for you. Well. Well, Sapper's got the money as a rich man. Under the under the table. <laughs> under the thumb, he's a rich man. Anyway, he's appointed Leonie Rose as his, his successor, and she is now the... Uh, general manager of Ignite oh, uh, yeah if you want to see that unfold and see the reaction I'll be watching very closely I will be wa- I'm I watch that. watch that yeah. because... absolutely I want to see this mm. yeah and see how it goes down you'll explain see explain yourself Mr. yeah explain Khan. yourself mister he's here tonight on Showdown he is he's wrestling this evening he is you'll see him in his bracket 2 wrestling match uh, yeah. bracket 2 super tag league yes wrestling match it's Mustafa Khan and Jonathan Cedric re- 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 renewing not reviewing renewing, renewing their bitter rivalry there you go uh, with the Brotherhood it took place at the weekend the Brotherhood did sort of cheat to win that match uh, it has to be said uh, and tonight they reignite that rivalry as part of the super tag league I have a question, Brett. Yes, what's that? At what point do we start referring to the Brotherhood as just the firing squad? Well, uh, I... Are they just the firing squad or are they the Brotherhood representing the fire squad? The latter. The firing squad. At the minute, anyway. That's that's my understanding until they tell me differently. Yes, until we get told off. (laughs) Damien Black, the head of the firing squad, is... Okay. Yeah, so there we go. There we go. That's about it for the pre-show, look. We've got to... The allotted time. The allotted time. A lot of time (laughs) is up. Uh, That's us done. We're going to go and uh, stretch our legs and... um, yeah. Have a lem sippy. I, I think I definitely need one of those. <laughs> uh, and we'll be back with Friday Night Showdown the start. The Super Tag League is here tonight. And we'll see you for Showdown in just a few minutes.